Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Today we got a special couple here, I guess, honey. He looked very special. So, and we got Bella Hadid and her boo, her new boo, Mark Coleman. Okay, give it up for these two, y'all. Bella, why? I mean, he just looked like trouble. He just looked like he gonna have her turned upside down, wide open, if she stayed with him for too too long. Okay, just look at his eyes, y'all. I just want y'all to look. But anyway, let's see what the cards have to say. I don't know this man now. This is just my opinion upon looking. Okay, he probably a good man. He probably a banker. Probably worth millions. I don't know, but it don't look like it. So let's see what's the current energy for Bella Hadid and Mark Coleman. Okay, what's the current energy for Bella Hadid and Mark Coleman? Okay, so the first kid thing came out here is children, honey. It says children. Your love life is being affected by children. Bella is Bella is the one that got a kid, right? Bella, please don't have your child around, Mark. Oh, I mean, just not for now. If you don't know him like that, just don't. Okay. So that's the card that struggled to come out, the children card, and that's an important card. Okay. So your love life is being affected by children right now. I don't know what exactly that means, but we're gonna pull on it. When it comes to her, I don't know what that means. So, is this a beware? Or do he got too many children and it's affecting? Is his baby mama stepping in? What's going on? Is your baby daddy having an issue with? Is Bella the one that got a baby? I don't know. I'm getting these girls confused. Either way, go children are affecting this relationship right now. So, let's see. What the, okay, so how are children are affecting this relationship right now? Divine Angel, how is children affecting this relationship between Bella Heavy and Mark Coleman? And they're like, oh. All right. It looks like we got somebody coming in being impulsive with the one. Being impulsive, coming in, you know, kind of steady with the one action being immature or youthful and then with the tower moment being reckless causing chaos I'm seeing chaos in the home coming in probably you now the one energy is passionate probably coming in loud fiery and probably angry okay or uh, I'm just going to leave it at that Okay. Either way, go watch your children around this around people. Okay, let's move on. Okay, so, and I hope she ain't trying. I hope she ain't pregnant with them, cause that that also could be that. But if that is the case, it's not gonna be a happy situation. It's not a happy situation, cause it's it's very unstable with the tower. But anyway, so let's see what the tower has to say about their current energy with Mark Coleman and. Bella Hadid. What's the current energy for these two? I don't think Bella has a baby. Does he? It's Gigi. Is this Gigi's sister? Yeah, this Gigi's sister. So she didn't get. Girl, I don't know. I ain't used to these folks having babies like this out here in these streets. We got the hyphen card here. Okay. This speaks of a maybe a marriage, a corporation, or joining together assets, maybe. They may just got married. This this giving me some type of marriage at the courthouse or maybe a marriage that's at um at the um what you call it, at the Vegas chapel. <laughs> it's giving me that type of thing. But then it's a five of cups situation, baby. Some somebody may be looking at this relationship as halfway full, like being positive about it, but then somebody don't see it as being very positive. We got the strength card. Okay, we okay, in the middle of the reading, somebody's gonna need strength to move forward. Some kind of courage they're gonna need. 
okay to balance out the past to balance out what they done went through honey you know went through a lot you know got drugs probably you trying to see the bright picture and then we got this queen of swords energy here the man in the truth okay wow now that's y'all energy okay i'm seeing them a marriage or joining together but somebody's not okay with that okay and they so not okay with it they probably expressed it and hurt somebody's feelings they sad about it and they're trying to find strength to move forward when it comes to this relationship and balance it out between probably two families or somebody's past somebody's past is coming back and hunting and honey it, since i know this is a hadith right here this could be very well her mother or this could be her okay this could be yolanda you, you know yolanda gonna be in it honey yeah she should have been stopped it but we got somebody that's trying to get the truth the man in the truth with their hand out and got their swords ready girl let's see what's going on it ain't giving love right now y'all it's giving a bunch of drama like i said when i look at him he just look like trouble okay give me more about the hyphen why is the hyphen card here for bella and mark all right it is here because I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. They having fun right now. Flirting. Dating. Okay. Want to date. But here we go with this lightning strike. Sudden change. A shocking news. A sudden epiphany. Um, some type of transformation going to happen here. Again, just like the reading we just had before with them. The butterfly. We got uh, the relationship is evolving to the next level. But you need to heal the inner child. Okay. So there's some type of inner child healing. Somebody got some type of traumatic past. I've seen a traumatic past with this card. The temperance card always gives me somebody trying to overcome their past and balance it out. Okay, sometimes it's a win, sometimes it's a lose. But for this queen to be behind it, that means somebody's demanding you to either straighten up or ship out. Okay, it's like before they're trying to give you courage to move forward. So don't please, please don't be one of these codependent relationships where you're a man on something, you're trying to love him past this addiction. Please don't. That's a lose lose. But the, the relationship is evolving to the next level, uh, but there's some um, inner child healing that needs to be done here. But it's a lot of passion, insane chemistry. They like each other equally and they're having fun. Okay, so it's a lot of chemistry, a lot of PDA, I've seen it. A lot of Courtney and Travis energy, I get. that You know, that raunchy love. I mean, I'm, I'm okay with a little PDA, but if when they get raunchy to the point that, it, that it's cringy, it's like, girl, stop. It ain't even cute no more. So why is the Five of Cups here for Mark and Bella? Uh, we got the engagement ring here. We got engagement ring, a partnership, a commitment, eternity. A completion, a union with the coffee cup, meeting and conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted, friendship. So it looks like, again, I'm picking up, they probably don't when they got married and the family, the people around them probably are not so happy about this. People do not see the positive side of it. And you may have some people that support it, some people may not. Okay, we got the strength card here. Why is the strength card here? Yeah, we got the mask card. Somebody been wearing the mask. He don't like him wearing the mask to me. I see him loud and clear. Okay. If somebody's not showing their true feeling, uh, some type of um, hidden motives, somebody pretending, um, gaslighting, and delude. Somebody is delusional with photograph, looking at the photos, missing you, nostalgia, making new memories. There's somebody going to rehab. Because you find them seeing him without his mask on. You're trying to love him past it. You're trying to get him strength to move past it. You see, she there's a female energy trying to guide this lion. This maybe Leo. Trying to guide him through. Because of his past. Okay, his inner child issues. She probably feel like she got the same inner child issues. They probably uh, trauma bonding. We got the tempers here. Why is it tempers here? We got twin flames okay yeah we got the bond here y'all it says the yin and the yang balance unity duality coupling completion um uh, it says complement each other so they probably complement each other you know they like to say 
they both have some type of inner child issues they need to deal with so therefore right now everything is all to the good honey I guess it's them against the world let's find out more about this queen of swords though because she's demanding something give me more about this queen of swords here for Mark and Bella okay so the card that didn't quite pop out but turned over here we got the not today okay somebody's not dealing with their true you know the true issue here it's some type of avoidance here avoiding the conversation avoiding the person not setting their boundaries and still angry about it and the second card that picked up here is the golden mirror which means somebody is self-absorbed a narcissist a one-sided relationship and we got love bombing going on so at by, by the end of the relationship the end of this thing somebody's gonna be demanding the truth okay because you they have been through this relationship not dealing with it avoiding the seeing the sign thinking this is some type of divine connection which it may be because maybe she, she, this the, he's the way that she's gonna heal her inner child because if you still dating somebody that look like this I mean his eyes just say that he just he weary or he's high or he's just woke up from a deep sleep or he need a nap ain't slept or dehydrated i mean it's just it's just say trouble it's like not taking care of yourself so if you're not taking care of yourself you can't take care of this woman okay and bella if you attracted to something like this which means you're not taking care of yourself which means you don't want to be taken care of and well kept so therefore you will continue to date somebody like this so there you have it okay but the card saying that they um they really do like each other y'all and this is a twin flame relationship whether good or bad okay they compliment each other even though they're gonna start mirroring each other and it's gonna be a narcissistic relationship and somebody's not really showing their true self so how can you mirror somebody if they're not really showing their true self to you and they gaslighting you but okay go off um but you have good conversations maybe okay he maybe got you a little ring honey you feel like this relationship is moving forward okay even though everybody's not okay with it but it doesn't matter because you feel like you guys are okay with and you're grown so go ahead but it does let me know to tell you to children are going to affect this relationship and children are innocent little people okay and they can't protect themselves against adults um mistakes okay so just be a aware of that okay whether it's his children i don't know if bella got children or not honey and i don't know if bella gonna have a kid with him but children are affecting this relationship so that's gonna be the reading for these two bella and mark i hope you enjoyed it catch me on the next one y'all i'll talk to you later bye